we will make Washington State a sanctuary state for the right of choice here in the state of Washington for other citizens as well. A promise by Governor Jay Inslee, cheered on by supporters on state capitol steps to make Washington a safe haven for abortion, along with partner states California and Oregon. I will be issuing an executive order to the Washington State Patrol not to cooperate in investigations of other states that would violate the Roe vs. Wade decision. Inslee called on lawmakers to extend that directive to local law enforcement. He's also asking them to prevent hospital mergers that reduce abortion access and to pass a constitutional amendment codifying the right to choice in the state of Washington. Keep your band on our body. Measures promoted by some abortion rights supporters, but that Senate Minority Leader John Braun believes missed the mark. While a very important issue, no question about that, when I talk to people around the state, they're much more focused on the cost of living in our great state. Lawmakers that do support these actions join the governor sharing their own experiences. This is hard on all of us. And pledging to take action where possible. At this dire time in our nation's history, I will not remain silent while this fundamental right is stripped from millions of my fellow Americans. The regional Planned Parenthood chapter says a spike in appointments from other states will likely have a ripple effect on services. We're asking 24 states to take the patient load of 50. That's real. The governor announced plans to put a million dollars towards shoring up extra resources. In terms of whether there needs to be more funding for services, certainly if that becomes an issue, we should talk about that. At the same time, we should talk about putting more money uh, for services for for women who choose to have birth. The governor believes that time to talk is now. We want them to know there's a wall in the West Coast protecting the women of the West Coast and the citizens that come from these other states. From Olympia, Erica Zuko, King 5 News.